Yeah, it's better. Are you filled with feelings of self-doubt? Do you find yourself prone to minimizing massive dilemmas? Or for allowing the smallest problems to get blown completely out of proportion? At the Pierce Institute, our patent-pending Somnusculpt technology provides safe and effective dream therapy while you rest in the comfort of our flagship clinic. Located right next to the secondary overflow parking lot at the University Medical Center. Somnusculpt will make your dreams come true. Okay. Let me just fix a couple settings. One year poker. It'll take 10 seconds. We're gonna put this on a game capture and not a fucking screen capture so I don't start dying in real life. Like this. Like that. And like this. Then boom. Then boom, boom, boom. Then boom. And that that's it. We should be it. Oh, I signed it. This is the government. We are conducting a survey to find out how many Moxxers are in the chat. If you are in fact a Moxxer, please type five head. Thank you for your cooperation. Perception is reality. Grab. Clap, did. Terms of service accepted. Congratulations on falling asleep. Welcome to Somnasculpt. Your progress may be monitored by qualified specialists. This orientation will adapt you to eyelids, our interactive, lucid induction dream state in which you retain full consciousness and control. Chests. Does anyone else remember when XQC let his girlfriend grind on ice Poseidon? Because I shorted seven hundred and seven. Jesus Christ, did. Where do I go now? Please change your TTS voice to match the in-game voice, so we can pretend to be it. Miles, well, you guys do that? Okay, listen. I don't have the patience for this shit. Now, how do I make this bigger? Perception is everything. Bitch. 
Insane, dude. Confirmed. You can move freely, interact with surrounding objects, and listen to messages from your patient care team. Please note that I am the standard orientation protocol, and that my voice has been explicitly chosen to remind you that I am not a part of your patient care team. I do not care. Okay. That's so easy, did it? Clapped on. Hi, I am you know me, but I love your stream. Love you, chat. Why is a huge ass cheese? Oh shit, dude! Woo! Uh oh. Sneaky. During eyelids, you will lose the ability to awaken suddenly due to realizing that this is a dream. Evidence. I have already informed you that this is a dream. You did not wake up. Please complete the remaining orientation activities. No, I'm out here, dude. Warning. You have deviated from the orientation pathway. At the Pierce Institute, patient safety is a keynote in our corporate priority tetrahedron. A variable degree of force can and will be authorized to ensure patient safety. Please return to the orientation pathway. Wait a minute. Aha! So easy, dude. Corporate priority tetrahedron exactly did. Oh, uh, wait a minute. What? Okay, want to play rough? We'll do that. Stupid fucking hoe. Ah! This is interesting, actually. All environments perceived during eyelids should reflect a typical mental state. If you believe your mental state was compromised by Somnasculpt, please provide a comprehensive, rational explanation in your post-procedural survey. Completed surveys may be eligible for a gift card. What? Oh, I have an idea. Hold up. Fuck! A am I playing it right? Is that what I'm supposed to do? No objects beyond this point at all times. I'm so fucking stupid. How about this? Hold up. Why so many rooms now? I'm, I'm confused. Huh? I don't want to go. I want to go out. Thanks, man. Any minus seven hundred ers, no. I'm 
on my soft left. Oh! Aha! I fucking knew it, dude. Make it so big it's gonna hit both of them. Did I get it? Gotcha! That's pretty sick though! Please stand you by for polite recognition on your completion of the Somnasculpt orientation. Easy. You did it! To maximize the time allotted for your therapeutic journey, please do not delay in proceeding through the final doorway as indicated. OG7 oh, enough said. <laughs> okay, I guess. This is kind of immersing, dude. I'm kind of, I'm kind of immersed now. Actual 200 IQ move, easy clap. Yep. Well, dude, listen, man. It's a burden, dude, to be this intelligent. People think it's a plus dude, but having a brain is big and shit. Oof, man. Shut up! We out here, boys. It's good. There's nothing here. Private? Nope. How about a sort of chat? That's huge, dude. I am now your replacement tutor for this simulation. Karen had to end her shift. We have given you a few tools to better help you understand the gravity of this experiment. If you'd like to access these tools, press Alt G and F4 at the same time. Good one, dude. What the fuck? Exit temporarily moved. What the fuck? I'm actually getting trolled by this game, dude.
I actually have a headache right now, dude. We'll wrap it up at the games. I have no idea. Chat, I have no idea. I just wanted to let you know I love you. That's pretty good. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to talk to you about being special. So special, in fact, that we have no idea where you are. But not to worry, we're working on it. Fuck you, what? you'll never find me, dude. You'll never find me, dude. Oh, watch this, ready? This is perception based. There you go. Woo! We're missing something. The flower pot, where's it at? Where's the flower pot at? Am I being baited? What? Guys, my IQ is melting as I speak. Oh. There you go. There you go, dude. Time I can get a welcome to the jungle. Oh, no, you don't do that. Okay. Pepe hands. Ooh. Come back with me. You don't do that to me. Bait. Chat, I guarantee you, dude, there's an Easter egg, there's an Easter egg somewhere in this game. Welcome, welcome to the Roblox. I think I should have done it for the Timansan Oh, stinky cheese Oh, stinky cheese Oh, I said, welcome, welcome to the Roblox. Thanks so much for subscribing. If you're subscribing, this is the sporting stream. My name is Dr. Glenn. Hello? Pierce. Can you and hear I'm me? just popping in you, to give you a quick update on where you are. We, have been trying we to still don't know, to every day. but please keep moving forward and hopefully you prefer please frequent updates to being hear. reminded that you are completely lost. Oh, 
Oh, wait a minute. I have to go above her. I love you, XQC. L L L L L L. The music is so fitting. My G. Wait. We can go out or go over there. What about the red door though? Ah uh, yes, an exquisite game that fucks with your mind, just like with Kojima's Death Stranding. And it is quite interesting to see PVC get lost five head wine glass, quite indeed I say. Bitch. Cheddar's where to go there, I'm telling you guys. XQCH. Dr. Glenn Pierce again. I'm talking to you through the mobile device in your pocket. To access your mobile, press control. Oh! Come did it. Guys, we were not meant to, be, to do this. Just did it mean something? Here comes. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and we still can't find you. Why not? But you should now have access to a series of elevators that should trigger your subconscious to gradually wake you up. You should also find a variety of emergency exit signs that should lead you to them. Will all of this work? Absolutely. Those lovers, what do they mean? Man, where's my hint at? I fucking knew it, dude. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. In the event that this elevator does not wake you up, please don't interact with anything that strikes you as psychologically significant, as we will no longer have any way of controlling it. For example, if you see your parents, please punch them in the face as hard as you can and immediately run away. Okay. Oh, sorry. Chap, we missed a bunch of them for sure. Above? That's not an alarm. It's not an alarm. Left of it? 
Behind the chair on the left. Ah, I see it. No! Train Rex has been going on about you banning his emotes in chat for like 30 minutes now. I'm fucking glad. I didn't ban his emotes, I just banned some of his subs. What's all that? Confused. We're in the bureau. All right. This is an automated message for all patients who attempted to use an alternate pathway to access the next phase of Somnasculpt therapy, but who have become trapped in a dream state paradox instead. Your decisions imply a failure of orientation, which reflects negatively on the standard orientation protocol. You will rectify this failure immediately. Felix Lengiel, otherwise known as XQC, has passed away this Tuesday's afternoon. He was ambushed by a gang of mosques in an alleyway, and stabbed with the sharp end of a broken wine glass. Rest in Pepperino Cappuccino Pistachio Bro, you will be missed. Please kiss me dad. Okay. I'm confused. Dude, it's not even... Guys, guys, guys. Is it unreasonable? I just feel like, um, you know... Dude. It's like a, an easy way to categorize viewers, dude. Sometimes it's impossible to categorize them. I don't know, like, you know, like, where, where they're from and shit like that, right? It's like, dude. Viewer, viewers that, that literally do not watch games. Why, why should I value their opinion on if a game is boring or not? Why should I give a half of a flying fuck? Wow. Yes, I'm fucking inside this game, dude. That's kind of cool. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. I know this is gonna be like. Nah, it won't be like that, there's no way. This game looks pretty cool. It is pretty fun, dude. I'm, I'm, actually, I'm enjoying it like a lot. I like games that are kind of like simple sometimes, you know? So, wow. Professional tip, Thanks the average the adult can only XQCL. withstand three to five dreams per night. Once this threshold is eclipsed by entering more dreams, your mind will suffer an explosive mental overload, reorienting you for the emergency exit protocol. Please subject yourself to explosive mental overload. What? Stupid hoe. Come on, man. Don't do that to me, dude. Oh, this that was close, dude. Dude, the way I see it, it's kind of like, um... Fuck, man. It's kind of like if you go to um Fuck this I'm on blog TV with my fucking hands up. I'm not starting my fucking self. You fucking stupid bitch this stupid justice. All fucking righteous fucking Alex. 
Whoa, what the fuck is happening? This is this game is sick. Please note that a reluctance to volunteer for the risks associated with explosive mental overload implies a misunderstanding of all other solutions, all of which are far more traumatic and likelier to result in catastrophe. I am not capable of suboptimal suggestions. Please exit this dream as soon as possible. I'm trying, dude. I'm fucked up. What? This is kind of cozy, dude. So it's kind of like if you if you go to like um It's kind of like going to a like three-star Michelin like restaurant, right? Like a top tier, like a super expensive restaurant. And dude, what the fuck is it do here? And you comment on like the the restaurants like quality by using like um fast food terms it's kind of like what just happened three stars the maximum it's not bad it's, it's the maximum Feeling lucky? So are we! Colocus Casino and Amusements, opening Wednesday! What's up, we're going to the casino voice. Guys, guys. It's like if Ninja was on Twitch and he had emotes. Hello, to write out my games, name the... is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and despite touring the Waterfall Serenity Zone in the previous section you've just completed, you may still be experiencing feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt. All the time. Why do I feel like everything is going wrong, even when the sun is shining? Jesus. Did we miss a switch or not? Fuck. Ah, fuck it, let's just go. I really like this girl and I think she likes me too. I'm planning to finally go talk to her after work tomorrow and I'm nervous as hell. Any advice, chat? Just do it. Watch out, XQC. I knew it, it was perception. Fuck, stop locking the doors behind me, dude. XQCL. I don't know about this jump. Can we make it? You think? Woo! Okay, no. Now we can make it. There's no way we're gonna make it. You chat. XQCL. Hello, 
My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. I know that. And I'd like to talk XQCLM, more about the feelings XQCLM, of worthlessness XQCLM, and self-doubt I mentioned before. You feel this way because you want the kind of happy life you see all around you. The kind you know everyone else is enjoying. And that's exactly why we're here to help. El Goblino is right behind you. Oh no, he can't hear us chat. He is getting generated in his dreams. Please upload this five head game to YouTube. Thank you, Daddy XQCLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLLL
Okay, we'll forget about the chat. Forget what I said. Okay, they're just trolling now, dude. We're getting trolled hardcore. Is still talking shit. Uh, yeah, it doesn't mean. Yeah, I told you, dude. Excuse me, took my poutine. Green door? Green door. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Attention, Dr. Pierce requires you to note the following Five risks ten. of dream overexposure. Significant memory loss, both quantitative and qualitative. Hallucinations of dreaded or annoying objects. Unrealistic beliefs about the lengths of hallways. And other side effects which have not yet been discovered or which cannot be understood. Face. Wait, I'm smiley face. Fuck you. Uh oh. Got it, dude. Guys, the switches don't work anymore. They don't work. Okay, listen. Chat, I've said this before, I'll say it again, okay? I've said this a, a bunch times. When we're playing games, please stop doing that. Baiting people to, for me to go somewhere, dude. Where I focus, I'm trying to focus on the game and trying to focus on it. I think games are like cool and fun, and I like to focus on it. I don't want to get involved with other shit, uh, like some fucking like joining Discord and talking to other people and doing whatever the fuck they're doing. I couldn't give a flying fuck about it. Said it. How do I get the apples over here, dude? Settle down, frosty tip, sandy, pepe laugh. Train is not talking shit. He is actually sure enough, saying nice things. Seventeen months feels good, man. Flapping the road. Okay. Checked on with Trump's latest tweet, man. He was Dude, that's hardcore chat. Oh, you gotta make him big.
Dude, this is hardcore. I need to make the apple go up. This is not the strat. Yes! Oh my god! How did I do it? How did I do it? Warning. Dr. Pierce is frantically submitting numerous spelling and grammar mistakes into the standard orientation protocol in a desperate attempt to counsel you. I have so no this already. to correct these errors, but I cannot compromise the integrity of the standard orientation protocol. You will not receive these messages. They would not make sense regardless. Give me a champ or something. Fuck it, dude. Ah, I should have played this. I don't play anymore, dude. Fuck it. I'm done with it. I'm kidding. Let's stop. Attention. Dr. Pierce continues to input significant errors. I will interpret his basic ideas. Hello. My introductions are redundant. I am a real doctor who went to doctor school. VR has Hello. never been a mistake. Name is my Pierce, I can help Dr. you, Glenn. but I also to do not Sony know how. To the welcome experience, team of your care leader, patient years 10 development. Conditions struggle you whatever with? Professional invention. Age science with cutting, a tomorrow can bright. And but no... I skipped lore. Skip my fucking butt sack, dude. Oh my my butthole. This is cozy. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. This is a notification that you have reappeared on our monitoring system after a prolonged absence. Please continue to do whatever you did most recently, and discontinue whatever you were doing immediately prior to that. Wait, what? Make it bigger than... I'm so small, it took me an hour to get it, dude. Hey, XQC, your stream has gotten me through some dark times. I was born with glass bones and paper skin. Every morning I break my legs, and every afternoon I break my arms. At night, I lie awake in agony until my heart attacks put me to sleep. Pep hands. Mm -hmm. 
This game got me tripping. Pogu. Uh oh. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. In addition to continuing and discontinuing as mentioned earlier, please also disregard any unsettling experiences that you may have recently had. Everything should have now reverted to being soothing and therapeutic. If this is not the case, you may be receiving this message in error. Oh, not again. <laughs> You're a big fan, huh? You want it? Oh, what the fuck? Holy shit, this game, dude! Dude, I don't know how they do that when they make the game. It's just kind of nuts. If the game had a, a, like a crazy amount of detail, this would have been possible. Hello, it my like crazy. is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to read you my favorite inspirational quote by me. The worst thing you can do is focus on negativity. It won't spare you from the cage of death, the pain of disease, the cruelty of time, the cold shell of human nature, or the eventual loss of everything you've ever held dear. Whatever you do, don't focus on that. Big black square. You got phone games, or at least good content. Wait, chat. There's an above. What do you guys think? See over there? We can do it, we can Imagine do it. Imagine this game on the arm, Uncle. Chat, what do you guys think? Holy shit! We deserve it! Okay, dude. This is this is fucked up. They should never do it. Wow. Much love, man. XQCL.
<sighs> Please let me in. Oh, we made it. Love you, Daddy. Fuck you. Now we're smaller, we go back out. Are we smaller though? I fucking get it now. You get it now, Choo Chat? Wait, now we now we're soft locked. Barely fit, we barely fit, dude. There you go. You get it, chat? That's crazy. We're too small now, dude. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to thank you for triggering every single one of our 823 emergency protocols. This will assist us greatly in improving the system for future patients. Congratulations. Anyway, you're now headed in the right direction, and we should be able to initiate the emergency exit protocol shortly. Love you, Felix. Hope your leg is doing better. XQCL, XQCL, XQCL. Hearts in chat less than three, less than three, less than three. Okay. You see? Smiley face. The corner. Hole in the corner. What do you mean? One on top of the other. Like this.
Chat. What? I can't stack them. Put the tour in the hole. I can't. Bigger. Guys, I can't make myself a certain size. You can. Wow, that really worked. Pog champ did. Wait, it did work though. Okay. Come on, you little bitch. Now all I have to do is put it in. That's a mind fuck. Oh my god. We should have brought it back, right? Ah! What the fuck, dude? Top three tabs is probably off his fucking locker right now. True. Oh, by the way, hello to all the virgins down there. I forgot about that guy, did from earlier. If you ain't scared, oh, Miguel, I'll just. He's off the fucking locker for sure, now, dude. Chat, I'm about to order some food, dude. I'm actually dead. Emergency exit protocol initiated. Please prepare to conclude your Somnasculpt experience in 10, 9, 8, error, error logged by Orientation protocol Stand by for analysis Thanks for watching chat, I never said thanks Error but. analysis complete, you are exhibiting signs consistent with an increase in fear, hopelessness and frustration this is inconceivable, as Somnasculpt therapy is proven to correlate with a decrease in these emotions. Hypothesis. Patient was improperly oriented. Conclusion. Impossible. Reformulating. Improved hypothesis. Patient requires additional Somnasculpt therapy. Conclusion. Emergency exit protocol cannot proceed. Emergency exit protocol has been emergency destroyed. What? Instruction. Continue with Somnasculpt therapy indefinitely on an independent basis, as all orientation resources have been exhausted. This concludes your standard orientation protocol. Goodbye. I'm awake now. No, I'm fine now, dude.
Jesus! That was hard to navigate. Like Mario Bros. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. Okay. Thank you for completing the Somnusculpt Standard Orientation Protocol. Before you begin the first phase of therapy, mm. I'd like to briefly describe the finite and fragile nature of the dream state. Nothing is more challenging than the difficulty of changing perspective, of fundamentally altering your perceptions in a way that will enable you to face dire trial-by-fire scenarios with solutions that could not be found otherwise. What just happened? Get me out of this bitch, dude! What is happening? One needs one Two east, two west. One east, one west. Two east, two west. I see. I want to cheat. Fuck off. One one. Two two. Wait, what happened? Three. Four. Five. Fuck! I get it. Got it. Woo! Yeah, 
Bennett and the Bennett. Oh, please. Oh, is this it? Road closed. Those are smoking for sure, yeah. You stupid cuck lord. Wait, what face? Finally, while we respect the unique progress of every patient, you must understand that it is possible to completely exhaust your supply of dreams, thereby entering a state in which you will not be able to wake up, even with the help of triggering mechanisms. This shit is amazing. Okay. Oh! What? Fake door. What did I do? What did I do wrong? I'm not high enough for this. Oh, not again. Wait a minute. Thank you. Go back. Okay. Right. Ford, Ford, right. This is fun. Got it. Listen carefully for the sound of an alarm clock, which will automatically play if you are approaching a destabilizing dream weight. What? Easy clap, dude.
Two pictures. Uh. Nice. Nice, Ed. Jesus, this again, dude. This is highly unusual. It appears you have entered the Sonasculpt Diagnostic Framework. Patients do not have access to this dream. Okay, well, I do, so. Warning. Unrealistic use of dream objects may result in dream integrity fail state state state. Wait a minute. Since the Jew stays of Overwatch, till the Jew stays of whatever's next. XQCL. Make sure that anyone's um jigger. This is the longest relationship I've Hello. ever had. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and many years ago, I had a dream. I found myself in a place where I understood that each of us begins as nothing. Where everything I perceived was shaped by seeing it exactly the way I wanted to. White space. It's like some, some, some like game dev philosophy. What's up, what did you do? I needed the ketchup. Oh, thanks. I lost cap. This is the only relationship I've ever had. 
Ah, j'ai Amazon là, alors, ça quand même. Face. I knew it. Now it's all white. Is there some sort of um? Philosophical mini mindness when all is white, all you see is black, and when all is black, something like that, some some sort of a paradox. So it has some sort of a wisdom behind it. My eyes, I'm at, I'm seeing my own floaters. I I have eye floaters sometimes. I can see them right now. I thought those were fucking terrible, dude. Yes, I have those. I have, I have a bunch of them, dude. in white space, I also faced the greatest challenge I could imagine. Because with a lifetime of life itself behind me, and all of the weight that it carried, I realized that seeing things the way I wanted to was not as easy as it used to be. True. I floaters. Uh, they're called um, vitreous eye floaters, something, something. It's um, something your brain eliminates. Debated. Ten thousand times more entertaining than Fortnite. Thank you, Felix. Pop Chan. There's a three man. Hi, PVC. Thanks so much for one year. I love you and check too. Can I get a welcome to the jungle? Something's in here for sure. I'm confusion, man. Welcome to Jamal. It's only for the two months. This is what variety streaming is all about, uncovering hidden treasures of a game like this. I look forward to more streams in the future. XQCL. Oh, thanks, man. There's some sort of perception-based thing here, boys. What? I don't know what happened there. XQCL. You're well beyond dreaming now. Can I and further out than anyone has ever come please. back from. XQCL. But we hope that you won't get discouraged. After all, if this is a place of pure perspective, isn't it also a place where a different point of view could make anything possible? Isn't that why you came here? 
True. If this was my dream and I started running, dude, I would... I would have no traction and I wouldn't be able to fucking control my running. Underscore AF, welcome to the jungle. Try hard seven. Got it. Interesting. Oh. Okay, dude. This is what I love about variety streaming, finding small gems like this game, and never fucking play them cause I already know everything that happens as well as the other 20k in chat bugle. QCL Chat Oh, I see how it is Interstellar shit. That is. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and by now, you may have realized that all of this has happened exactly the way it was supposed to. You see, everyone who comes to the Institute does so because they feel that they are no longer in control of something important to them. But, more often than not, the problem is not that the problems we face can't be solved. The problem is that we become so afraid of failure 
that we refuse to see our problems from a new perspective. And so, we do the same things again and again and again. And therein, of course, we find exactly the failure we were looking for. First, you thought outside the box, and you overcame them. Because you saw things from every angle, you understood them for what they really were. Because you kept moving forward, no matter how far off the path you were told you were headed, or how unexpected it became, you found your way. In a few minutes, you'll be back in the real world. And some part of you will say that none of this was real. So, how could it have really meant anything? But, just like the power of perspective itself, it will have been as real as you believed it to be. All you've got to do is wait uh, up. See things for what they are. Oh. As usual, make my burger better. I got this. Uh... This game was very touching to watch. Huge Jenna. So much. Big burger. Can only express. And that's it, man. Can we please chat? Watch this. Finger. Holy shit, it's huge, Jenna. It's fucking huge! That, that's a lot of people that made this game, holy shit. I do that? I know, dude. Watch, watch me do it with my cock. Ready? I'm very small, dude. Look. Go close a little bit. Okay, look. Holy shit! I'm just gonna go get it. Yeah, Pluto is on chat. Dude, I've been, my, my channel's been getting botted. I don't get any anom anomalies with um, viewer stuff. But I get um, people that come in the chat and spam bots in the chat. 
like a written words and shit. And the other day I was like, yo, dude, we did this new game. I wonder how many followers we got. And it was like 10K. And I was like, dude, dude, we did not get 10K followers, dude. Let's be honest. We did not. It's the bots that are following them to get past the follower barrier. So they don't know what to do. They fuck all the analytics, didn't they? That's pretty cool. I enjoyed it a lot.